Hey everybody, and welcome back to Kingdom Hearts. Welcome back to Monster of the Whale. Monster of the Whale going to normal drive and battle level 5 in Kingdom Hearts. It's all shit. Yeah. I'm glad we're all so hyped today. We're all on our way. Everyone's excited for 3 Hyphen's World. <laughs> We've never seen a battle level 5 before. Like, what are we gonna see? I don't know what Hyphen Land entails. Yeah, plus I love flying. Just gets me good. Gets me going. We got no. This is supposed to be a toilet. Oh. Yeah. Wait, you mean the enemy so. ships or your ship? My ship. That's <laughs> a little Kingdom Hearts fun fact for you. This is the canonical form of the enemy ship. Yeah. Oh, geez. It's, uh, remember I was in the toilet one day when he was thinking of this game, and he, uh, Looked back at it and was like, wait a second. That'd be a really good ship, is not it? If I could fly on this toilet, I'd be the king of the world. The king of farts. <laughs> Sitting on his porcelain <laughs> throne. <laughs> and his friend was like, wait, king of farts. We got something, but let's change it to hearts instead. Ah! And that's how Kingdom Hearts was born. Strange distant planet of the ocean. <laughs> okay, so I I live in a desert. Is this what water looks like? Yes. I've never seen it before. Oh, large bodies of water come in stone orbs. That makes a lot of sense. This is exactly how Atlantis disappeared. It just went space. I the ship <laughs> crash on the sea. Sebastian, they don't look like one of them. Right, Flounder? I don't know. There's something weird about them. Uh, <laughs> uh, what do you mean? Hmm, they do seem a little different. Where are you from? Uh, we're from kind of far away. And we're not really used to these waters. Uh, <laughs> uh, no, oh, I see. In that case, uh, Sebastian can show you how we swim around here. Ariel! King Triton will not like this! Oh, don't worry. Turtley, he's just very torn up over whether or not this is racist. He's wearing <laughs> a fish leg. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's just what the ocean is like, Mom. <laughs> <laughs> I... You can't just wear fish fins and call yourself a fish sword. It's more than that. It's a culture. The ocean has no culture. It is an anarchist wasteland. So I love the shitty Cassio version of this song. <laughs> Yet, this is probably still the most noticeable track on the soundtrack so far. Has <laughs> any other level actually used a song from the movie it's about? I don't think so. Yeah, I don't think so. But I'm not 100% sure because my Disney knowledge is pretty limited. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we should. This is the first one that's actually a cover. Uh, also, here is kind of a big minus point with uh, this world in particular. Swimming is kind of problematic. It's uh, It really makes it a lot slower to actually move around than you would normally. Well, I mean, you're a fish. You're not used to that. It's gonna be We're not from these waters. <laughs> Good job! Now let's move on to self-defense! Sebastian! Eh? Crash is over! Good luck! <laughs> Anyway, uh, these are uh, jellyfish uh, rockets, and uh, uh, 
most of the things they do is just kind of a spin attack that closes in on you. You can protect them when they actually do the spin attack, though. That's so good at dying, they don't do anything. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We saved Atlantica. We can leave now. <laughs> Good to see that our current weapon is a gear on a stick. <laughs> <laughs> Just like the speed punk gods wanted. I'll save it. Oh my god. It's beautiful on sea. Where did it come from, Lois? It's not you, Sebastian. Did you fart that out? <laughs> So terrifying. The shadow to save him. Ah, cool, we get to meet the king. Oh, that's yeah, I think cool. I think you're on the right track with this anarchist wasteland. The ocean's crawling with gang tags. <laughs> <laughs> this is Poseidon's territory. Oh, bye Donald. So besides the fact that Ariel Hexy ran away. Like before, she's now a party member. <laughs> now oh, she can okay. defeat those jellyfish, no problem. Now she has the fighting spirit after watching you fight. Vent in the bottom of the sea, that's Atlantic. <laughs> that's, I mean, that's the major landmark. <laughs> <laughs> you know, we could probably convince probably convince her to buy your gear stick for an outlandish amount of money. <laughs> it's from the surface! It does something. It has moving parts. I think you might be onto something here, Loon. I was gonna overthrow the monarchy, but scamming is good enough. <laughs> you know, Sora, I'm pretty sure Fens are supposed to be on your back. Let this night fool rest. Because Goofy's the one that decided what sort of <laughs> Goofy is some out of line. Goofy just draws out like some shitty concept art and shows it to Donald all the time. This is what I've got to look like if I'm under the ocean. <laughs> he just like scribbles Sora in after he meets him. Well, now the Sora's with us. What happened if we shut up? I mean, that's probably why his design is least changed, because he goes like, Whoa, well, oh, this boy's got a fit now, that's it. <laughs> I'll see you later, Mushroom. Oh, hi. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, uh, common creatures in the ocean. Jellyfish, ghosts. <laughs> that's it. I mean... That's the only thing that lurks in the ocean here that is hostile to people. The ocean is one of the most haunted biomes. <laughs> Doesn't the aerial live next to like a ship graveyard or something? I thought that was funny. Probably listen. All I know is that the ocean is basically just one really big haunted house. Yeah. That's pretty cool. One other end. Is there any other Take a fish, see? <laughs> where's like, where do we just like a fish? Like not even heartless fish, just fish. <laughs> Come on, just wait a bit. Just want to beat the shit out of a trout. Fuck you. <laughs> now we just have to beat on the spineless and the sins of our past. Like here's hey. a It's a merman. Uh, it's not actually a merman because that would mean you have to so, I kicked his ass, that's what happens. <laughs> so, uh, those were my. They're pretty shitty groups, but I'm not too bad. They generally just, like, uh, kind of just zoom in on you constantly. Oh no, they're trying to keep us away from the bad painting. <laughs> <laughs> Or they just do normal like late attacks. They're kind of the sword guys in this area, except under the ocean. Right. You just can't have swords under the ocean, that's just sad. Yeah, that's just dumb. Also, sometimes they'll just throw a temper tantrum. <laughs> just like me.
That was too close. As long as I have my trident, I will not tolerate those creatures inside this palace. Daddy? Oh, Ariel, when will you listen? It's dangerous out there. Um. Strange creatures lurk outside. <coughs> Behold, you swim before the ruler of the seas. His Majesty, King Triton! And who are they? They helped us fight off those creatures. They don't look familiar. We're from an ocean very far away. Yup, yup, we came to find the keyhole. The what? What's that? Well, it's a... There's no such thing, certainly not here. But Daddy... Ariel, not another word. You are not to leave the palace. Is that clear? Oh, perhaps I'm being too strict. I'm just concerned. For her safety. Of course, Your Majesty. But I must admit, now I'm quite curious about this keyhole. That need not concern you, Sebastian. Have you anything to report? Just as you suspected, Your Majesty, they seem to be coming from Ursula's Curato. I knew it. That sea witch is up to no good again. I see exile from the palace has taught her nothing. Yes, she poses serious danger. And I told you to keep Ariel away from such danger, did I not? Your Majesty, please, I... This is just a very poor kingdom, okay? The economic <laughs> recession hit them very hard. It's like you saw this palace. Well, oh, I'm king. I gotta try it. Yeah. I'm the king of this land now. It's yeah. made of gold. It's the official, like, uh, king uh, mineral. <laughs> oh, we get to go to Ariel's Grotto. It's a dolphin. Let's fight it. Uh. <laughs> We are not going to fight Dolphin, the friendliest creature known to man. The ocean, it's kill or be killed. Future friend, don't just leave Ariel to fight on her own. Oh, it's time for a musical now. You just collected a bunch of boxes. That's all you did. <laughs> and pots. And bottles. I mean, I've seen plenty of other worlds. And they all sucked. I don't want to do it again. I almost got killed by a gorilla? Oh, I don't. you probably don't know what those are. Well, I mean, I got eaten by a whale. You know what those are. <laughs> what if I, from this ocean, go up to the surface and go ashore and then make my way to middle Africa? I find a completely different middle? Are there infinite possible middle Africans? Or is it all the same middle Africa? <laughs> hey, look at it this way. My world was destroyed. Yeah, that's my cottage. It's <laughs> mine now. It's my storm pit. Stop stealing my stuff, Sora. Oh, that's it. my bank account, Sora. <laughs> <laughs> that's my social security number. Sora, you can't be me. Got that globe sitting there in Africa's front and center. That's probably the same <laughs> texture they put on a map in the Tarasad level. <laughs> it all makes sense. Flounder's gonna be even creepier when he grows up and his eyes slide to the one side of his face. That's a flounder, right? That I'm not getting that fish wrong. Yeah, that's flounder. Flounder okay. the flounder. Ha! 
Those impudent fools will never find the keyhole. But the girl could prove useful, and I've got the heartless on my side. Triton, my old friend. <laughs> Your day is coming. <laughs> <laughs> so here's a uh, problem with uh, this part. So essentially you were supposed to clear the entire uh, couple of areas of enemies. Right. Uh, because the dog will else not go where you want them to go. Uh, but the big problem here is that it's kind of random whether the dolphin decides every enemy is defeated or not. Uh -huh. Like, I've... Uh, I cut out, like, me clearing the next couple screens, like, two times, and the dolphin did just not want to go. Okay. Just wanted to smoke weed and listen to these fat jams. The only thing that dolphin wants is to discover which parts of your body make strange noises when it stabs them. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, dolphins are assholes. I wouldn't trust them with my life. Or even just giving me directions. Excuse me, dolphins are cute. I will trust them with my bank pass. That dolphin is sizing you up for a coffin. <laughs> dolphins won't steal my credit cards. They are friendly and trustworthy. They would just steal your cyber identity. Just crawl into your skin where you were around. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me, I think you mean sharks. Sharks are big in cybercrime. No, I was thinking the dolphins. Though the two are very similar. Well, maybe you're thinking wrong, dolphin boy. Maybe dolphins are just like oh. sharks. Maybe they are just sharks. Why don't you beat up that mushroom? But the f don't beat him up. I just want some magic spell or something. I will beat up whatever I want to, especially now that the fucking dolphin is where I want them to be. <laughs> Yeah, it's not just to mess you up in fights. It's going to mess you up in fights, though. <laughs> well, I mean, yeah. <laughs> it's just that's not the only thing it does. You can hold me fast. You can't write the dolphin, they're enemies. They're just jet stream. I just ran away. Just like Huge. a dolphin wolf, because they are innocent, friendly creatures. We wouldn't harm a fly. That's a lie. <laughs> Oh, that was a nice trip. Yeah. yeah. So, you talked about that ship graveyard, huh? Yeah. Well, look where we are now. Oh, the cool shit. Oh, I love this level of Super Mario. Yeah. Just like the movie. Yeah, that's right. Oh, that was just like the movie. Gonna go inside, there's gonna be a dolphin, and it's gonna devour you. <laughs> oh, god, yeah, just like the movie. <laughs> See, that was just a giant dolphin. <laughs> Just a very fat dolphin. Look, I'm not going to judge it based on its body size. I'm not that kind of person. I will. I'm going to call it the fat fuck dolphin. Wow. Look at all these secrets. Oh my god. Nah. Goofy, come <laughs> Just push his area. <laughs> <laughs> Reminds me of something. Hmm. Reminds me of that fat fuck dolphin who just tried to eat me. <laughs> nah, whatever, I don't care about that. What doesn't remind me of that, though? Anyway, uh, welcome to a fight against the fat fuck dolphin. Uh -huh. This guy is kind of annoying. He will pop up and loads of the room and he'll just catch him on the uh, He can kind of just catch him with him because he will kind of get out of his stuff very quickly. Uh -huh. He kick your ass. Yeah, he kicked my ass hard, boy. Oh, he comes back. But yeah, he comes back once in a while, like, um, uh, both open areas, like the really open areas you saw before. Mm -hmm. So he can be kind of a problem. But either way, it doesn't matter now, because now we're going back to the dank ass grotto. Love that place. Knocking your head on the chest stuff. I like how frequently you just like ignore all the enemies. Let the other two fight. I don't like this world at all. 
I, I don't care for it, and I just want to have it done as soon as possible. Oh, it's even worse than Deep Chunk. Yeah, this is probably my least favorite worlds. Ariel, you've disobeyed me again. I told you not to leave the palace. Daddy, no! How could you? Young man, you're not from another ocean. You're from another world, aren't you? Huh? Then you must be the key bearer. How did you know? You may fool Ariel, but you can't fool me. You don't know your dorsal fin from your tail. Uh. As the key bearer, you must already know one must not meddle in the affairs of other worlds. Of course I know that, but... You have violated this principle. The key bearer shatters peace and brings ruin. Oh, Sora's not like that. I thank you for saving my daughter, but there is no room in my ocean for you or your key. My, my. The poor child suffers such deep sorrow. What a pity. If only there was something we could do. Wait, maybe she can be of some help. Yes, maybe she can be of some help to you. Who are you talking about? Oh, she would surely help you. She'd make all your dreams come true. Ursula can help. My dear. You're Ursula. Well, I was just wondering if... It's all right. Helping others is what I live for. Let me guess. You wish to see other worlds. <laughs> that shouldn't be too hard. After all, your new friends came from another world. What? But they had special help. That mysterious key. Now, now, cheer up, sweetie. You have something special, too. Huh? Now listen carefully. 